Charlie Parsons for Boxing Social and Association with William Hill and Empire Fight Store. Always a pleasure to be back with my good friend in Cardiff, Wales, Mr. Joe Calzaghi. A bit different from Vegas, but how are we, mate? Yeah, I'm good, thanks, mate. Completely different. Um, all good, all good. Looking forward to uh, the fight on Saturday, obviously. You know, well, tomorrow, you know, uh, big time boxing back in uh, Cardiff. Yeah, it's going to be a great fight, Rakimov and, uh, and Joey Cordina. Um, what can I say, you know, uh, Cordina was explosive last time he was in Cardiff with a, a great win, a great knockout win, and um, yeah, I'm uh, looking forward to him regaining the title tomorrow. And promote our responsibility today, doing the face-offs, something a little bit different? Yeah, I don't know, a face the pole, you know, like... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, it was good, and uh, you know what, it's, uh, it's nice to sort of be there and see the, the head-to-head, you see some needle matches there, you know, and... Uh, just before the fight, that's, that's what you want to see. So, yeah, they both look confident. I think um, Rakibov look more drained at the weight. Um, obviously, probably, you know, going to ju- obviously get themselves fueled up and ready for a big fight tomorrow, but looking forward to it. It's going to be a great fight. Joe Cordina's obviously got the city supporting him. You go outside the motor point, you see the photos, walk around all over Cardiff, and you see a lot of photos of him. Um, Wales always support their own, as they did with you and as they did with Lee. Now his opportunity, a bit of a different scenario, becoming two-time world champion in the one-weight division, still keeping the O, but you believe he can do it come Saturday night? Yeah, I believe he can do it. Um, like it's unfair, I think, really, and unfortunate that uh, yeah, the title taken off him yeah. due to injury. Um, so, obviously, Rakimov, well, watched, actually, box uh, in Abu Dhabi and um, against the Baron, the Baron dropped him. So I think uh, the styles make fights, and I think uh, Rakimov is, is suited for Joey Godina's style. I think you know he's got more boxing IQ, he's got the punching power as well. I think he's going to be really determined, especially being out of the ring for so long and frustration, and put on a great show like he did last time. So I'm really looking forward to it, and I, I see him winning. Joe, you know what we're like. We've got to get the clicks. Mr. Carl Froch is calling out everyone at the minute. It seems like he's got back and forth with Darren Till, and he's always mentioning your name still. Uh, what do you make of it? I don't make anything of it really, mate. I'm, I'm sort of uh, like, um, do you know what? That's the thing. I, like I said before, it's social media now, mate. So um, this money made in social media. You look at Tommy Fury, how much money they got they got paid, you know. Um, what do you make of it all? Like I said, when I had the fight, mate, I was, I'm, I'm old school. There was no social media, you know. You had to go in the ring and kick ass and do what you have to do. Um, but I suppose that's the pantomime of social media at the minute. And uh, listen, the guys can make them lots of money. Good, good on them. That's what I'm going to say, mate. Good on him. That's what I'm sort of quickly going to ask you. Um, we talk about the financial aspect involved. I know you're at a point where a lot of fighters retire and they almost wish that they gave a bit more, but you've sort of never really had to have any regrets like that. But if there was a good financial offer for yourself and Carl and sort of or something along those lines to have a bit of fun, maybe four-round exhibition, could you see yourself doing it? Four-round exhibition? what people are paying for nowadays, Joe. Yeah, you know, 10 million quid, no problem. I'll, I'll fight anybody put Would the Would you rather it be longer than four rounds? Nah, come on, man. You're just trying to, it's just uh, ridiculous questions, mate. It's oh. like, it's so old, these questions, you know what I mean? You know, undefeated 46 and 0, mate. At the end of the day, I don't feel I, know, I need I know, I know. to come back out of any know, sort absolutely. of retirement. And I've had, listen, there's been loads of fighters. I can name you like seven or eight ex-world champions that have uh, asked me to do exhibitions and fights. Thing is, if I was in great shape, which I am sort of getting there a little bit. I lost a bit of weight, you know what I mean? If I'm in excellent shape, then I suppose um, maybe have a little dance about.